Well, it's only 10 degrees here in Montana, and you're probably wondering why the heck is this guy out shooting his bow in the snow? Well, a thousand miles south of here in the great state of Arizona, the mule deer are just starting to rut. And anybody, yes, anybody can go down and get an over-the-counter archery deer tag, which is exactly what I'm preparing for. Let me explain. <laughs> My name is Steve Drake, and I'm partnering with Onyx Hunt, Matthews, and Loophole on a new video series called Anybody's Hunt. The goal of this series is to share hunting opportunities that are available to anyone and just show how much fun they can be and also give as many details as possible on how to do these hunts so that you can go do them as well. For this first series, myself and three friends, Zach, Jordan, and Connor are heading down to Arizona to do over-the-counter archery mule deer. Here's a little teaser of what's to come. All right, let's dive into this opportunity and just discuss more details on the hunt. First off, the cost of this hunt is relatively inexpensive. It's $160 for the hunting license, which you buy online through the Arizona Game and Fish website. And once you're down in Arizona, you buy the deer tag, that's 300 bucks, and you can buy that over the counter from anywhere that sells licenses, such as Walmart. Round trip for me to drive from Montana all the way to Arizona and back is about 300 bucks in gas. Per person, we're doing about $100 in food. So in total, you're looking at like less than $900 to do this hunt. So this season, it runs from the middle of December through the end of January. January. And the tag is good for either mule deer or coos deer. If you want to hunt uh, mule deer during the rut, I would suggest going in December. And then if you want to hunt coos deer, they're typically rutting in January. Roughly 50% of Arizona is public land, which equates to about 50,000 square miles. So there's really no shortage of places to hunt. And fortunately, there's, there's basically deer in every single hunting unit. I did this hunt last year, and the first place that I looked for information was the Arizona Game and Fish website. If you click on the hunting tab and then you go over, uh, there's a little box that says where to hunt. And if you click on that, um, Arizona is super awesome. They provide a ton of information. Basically, they break down every single hunting unit in the state and they provide a bunch of detailed information, including like general areas of where to find deer within those hunting units. So it's a really, really great place to start. There's a lot of unknowns in hunting new places and that could be really daunting. And one of our goals with this series is to answer some of those unknowns and make this hunt more attainable for anyone that's interested in doing it. That said, we're just starting to pack up. Uh, the gear pile has started, as you can see. For the next video in this series, we're gonna dive into all the gear we're taking, logistics, uh, what we're doing for food, camping, etc. So we'll see you next time.